Now I'm gonna show you uh, another building which is uh, made in 1500s and uh, it's very old. Uh, I mean, you can see that it is really authentically uh, from the Middle Ages. It is uh, also with um, frescoes and it has this little uh, jutting out terrace room. I mean, this area seems to be really uh, the real thing. I can just imagine they were all living so close together. It reminds me of Florence, you know, <laughs> because they were so close, such a close-knit community. But, um, you know, here people didn't make um, corridors, uh, you know, so that, uh, in order to avoid the poor, <laughs> which is what happened in Florence. And um, so um, I just wanted to show you the real medieval part of Colma, and that's why it's, it's so famous. But, um, yeah, now this is a chocolate uh, producing house. Very beautiful. And this is, uh, this is about the house itself. It was uh, made in 1527 uh, and then uh, restored in 1577 and then acquired in 1723 and restored again in 1840 so you know it's got all the history of it it is amazing and this is um, now to find the name of the street you know <laughs> this is going to Musee Bartoldi and this is Rue Schongauer because uh, Colmar was part of Germany for some time and uh, probably under the Kaiser but you know I can't find any other street names here so that's going towards Petit Venice and these are obviously from later later times uh, 1700s <coughs> But it's interesting too, look, you know, they, they've restored them and kept them. Whereas, uh, you know, in other countries, uh, you know, you may have these old buildings, but they, they never restore them, they never keep them, and uh, uh, don't value. Yeah, so, uh, that's a pity.